Well, one group who might be looking to advance their career options are teenagers, and summer jobs are essential for them. But new numbers suggest they could be keeping the service industry afloat. Our Caroline Sweeney visited one summer job staple and found out how teen employment is helping out. There's a shakeup happening in the employment market. We get a lot of high school kids, of course. Hi, welcome to Honey Hut. More 14 to 24 year olds have jobs this summer. Do you want the whipped cream that comes with that? Many, like Grace Kelly. All right. I've worked here since I was 15. 50 cents your change? Are in the food and service industry. Right, that'll be right out. I can help you if you're ready. Since pandemic lockdowns lifted, food service has struggled to rebound. Here you go, thank you. It was 14.25. Conversations about better pay don't always trickle down to a summer job seeker. Minimum wage at Ohio is like around nine bucks an hour and they get maybe two bucks an hour tips. Can I have change so I can tip you? So that's not bad, 11 bucks an hour for, for a 15 year old kid. In May of this year, there were more than 1 million unfilled positions in jobs around the country. Jobs. It's a strawberry cheesecake twister. <laughs> Open and filled by Grace and other employees at Honey Hut. Otherwise, we would cut back on a day. We wouldn't be open on a Mondays, for example. Here's a strawberry oh cheesecake twister. God. Ice cream. I've got the chocolate and vanilla shakes. May seem like a seasonal industry, but Bruce Page says once school starts, his workforce gets smaller. He tries to be flexible with employees who still want to work and go to school. Let them uh, have their days off that they want. Don't overwork them. But for many industries, the workers who returned for summer may not be replaced once school starts again. Um, let me have a five and five singles. Kelly says the growing number of workers her age says all it needs to say about her generation. People I know my age are some of the hardest working people I know. And I get a vanilla. Employment numbers are growing, but so is unemployment. Uh, junior chocolate. The national number is 5.9%. Here's the cone of chocolate. The pine will be right out. Caroline Sweeney. Here's a chocolate shake. News 5. Here you go.